Hi everyone, welcome to Color Conversations with Crawford Street. Today's color that we are discussing is Sherwin-Williams number 6251 Outer Space. It is definitely a darker, deeper color. Its LRV is 12. Um, it is, oh man, we love us some outer space. Okay, so this is like a charcoal navy. It's like a deep blue for sure. Like you're gonna definitely get a deep blue effect. It's gonna be, it's not navy. Um, actually we tried, we kept trying to call it a gravy cause we were like, it's like a navy, but gray. And then we were like, gravy is just, it doesn't work for a paint color when we're trying to talk about a charcoal blue. So it definitely is gonna pull blue. It's definitely gonna pull dark, but it's muted and it has gray to where it almost feels like it literally got this like wash of charcoal on top of it, you know? Um, so places that we've used this and loved it are, I'm just gonna tell you my favorite is probably cabinetry. So we did um, a new construction community and this was one of the um, six cabinet color options that were available to the homeowners. And probably 25% of the homeowners chose to have this cabinetry in their kitchen in some way, shape or form, either all of it or just the lowers or the island alone. Um, but this is beautiful on cabinetry. It gives the um, moodiness and, and like the elegance of a deeper cabinet and it gives that kind of contrast and that grounding um, piece that, that you need sometimes in your lower cabinetry or in your vanity piece. You know, sometimes if you have a lot of tile work going on in your backsplash or in bathrooms behind it or whatever, you'll feel like um, you need a good grounding piece. And sometimes wood doesn't work in that space or in the way that it's set up, wood would maybe be too harsh of a component to throw in in, in that element. Maybe the wood should be in just the window, I mean the mirror trim or something. So how do you get um, a, a color that grounds the space, but that still feels really nice with tile that gives some contrast? Oh my goodness, outer space is, it's phenomenal for cabinet color. So like I said, it's going to go with grays and it's going to go with cool. So if you are in a bathroom and you've got a lot of tile or if your kitchen has the gray veining throughout your countertops, um, this is going to play so nice with anything gray because of its cool tones. Now on the flip side, it pairs so beautifully with warms, like warm wood. Now, not necessarily that you want to go and, and, and throw too much uh, warm at it, but like a warm metal, a, a champagne gold or a brass, a brushed gold on this is absolutely beautiful. It's almost like a night sky with a scar, a star twinkling, truly. So um, it's got the depth of like midnight. You know what I mean? Like it's got that um, almost mysterious look to it because of its, um, its depth, its deepness. Um, and, but, it, but it plays so nice and Southern and light and homey because of its blue. Um, so it's, it's such a great color. It goes, like I said, with warms and cools and with darks and lights, and it goes with different styles. It's very, it could be very, very, very industrial. It could be very professional. It could be very masculine. Like I said, it could be very Southern and whimsical. Um, it's a great all around color. Like I said, sometimes people want contrast. Sometimes they want a good, um, deep color. They, they want, um, definitely that, that effect of like, I went for it, but I don't want black and I don't want just gray. I still want something to feel, um, like I, like it has color to it. You know, it's safe while still being stylish. Um, so other places this looks great is exteriors. It is so nice because of all the reasons I just said, because of the fact that it's blue and gray and it can go, you know, like if you mix in a red front door and it's got white shutters or, um, opposite, it's a white house and this is your, your trim and you have a red front door. It has a very Americana effect and that's when it can play into its kind of navy gravy, um, family, color family. But then also if you just had 
another palette of other grays in like maybe a warmer grayish and then a lighter um, soft gray white, then this is really just going to feel deeper and, and gray. It's not going to pull so colored. Um, it's it's going to pair so nicely with brick. People that have red brick find it hard to find a color. This is a great color to pair with even a bold brick because it's almost like, hey, I'm a bold color too. I'm, I'm bold in my depth and I've got a color going on, but I'm going to absorb anything and, and almost help balance out the boldness of like a red brick or an orange roof or something like that. Sometimes this is a great complimentary color to go on the exterior. It plays so nicely in in light and it plays so nicely in depth. The great, oh, the super, super awesome thing about this is that it is blue enough to go with black. So again, say you have black appliances or black gutters on the outs outside or black furniture in some place and you think, well, I wanted to go navy, but navy and black are gonna look like a big bruise. This is your navy. It will give you the same effect. Um, like I said, so then if you wanted to throw in some navy striped pillows or, you know, some red, white, and blue, or you have a team that's, you know, like navy and gold or whatever, this will still give you the effect of navy while still playing so nicely with black. So black hardware, even on this, still pops. Black furniture, black lighting, you know, things like that. So it is truly a... Um, a color that adapts well to its surroundings and it plays so well with other colors. Like I said, it can be the stylish color that you need, but it can also be the color that is reining in other bolder colors. Um, so try it out, see what you think. Um, especially if you use it on cabinetry or on your exterior, if you use it on an accent wall or ceiling, um, even a nursery or an office, gosh, there's just so many places. Every time we use a great color, we're like, we could use this in 30 different homes. So if you guys do and you use it, please send us pictures. We'd love to see what you thought of it. Um, and reach out if you have any more questions or if you actually want to see some of the projects that we did with Outer Space, then let us know. Um, again, it was Sherwin-Williams 6251 Outer Space a charcoal blue, deep, rich, beautiful color. Okay, great having a conversation with you guys. Love talking about color. See you next time.